This game. This game should win all types of awards because, first of all, co-op is amazing. And that's really all I gotta say. The whole game is about collaboration, <laughs> that little book keeps saying. But, oh yeah, I'm spoiling this whole thing, basically. But it's still worth playing, even if you're somebody who went and watched the entire the thing through someone I else's video, played. you should you definitely to, check out this game. Like, it's amazing. It's fun. You get to play with another person, and co-op games used to be my dream, but yeah. They started trying to, I guess, get rid of those types of games, but... <sighs> It's nice to be back. Now this right here is just... <clears throat> Gotta clear my throat. It's ridiculous, honestly. The bosses are kind of like overkill-ish, but still fun. I don't know, I can't really say too much for kids because they probably can do this, but I don't know about the cooperation part. They might be able to, but I don't know. It's just fun. <laughs> you can hit the button. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh god, that mouse hole. First of all, this child has too many toys. Second of all, I don't know. I like playing this. I like the challenge of getting through it and it's like you can't just get through it by yourself you have to do it with somebody this took us a minute to do because at first we were just going about it like you pick up a car you hurry up pick up a car we were matching making trying to make matches by without helping each other but obviously we don't listen and they know don't want to not make that cat but We'll let them dream. A this game. I want to win some prizes. It's all fun and games until you get in the water. I did not expect that, but it was surprising. That's it. A lot Don't of surprises I get a teddy bear or something? Game. Yeah, I was determined to go back down the slide and make sure I got out of there before that thing came up. Didn't get me. This part, oh my god. Stuff always happens when you're trying to have fun. Oh god. What is he? That was funny. Because I was like, I'm not gonna join in, but I did it anyway and I got smashed. Oh lord. That just was terrible. But it was fun. It was. The co op Nothing of this to game it. Just, no and the props. little mini games, like. It's a hit. Come on. This game That's is just right. amazing. Come on. If you Whoa, haven't played that was it, close. Let's try it. Play. You can play online with other people if you don't have another person to play with. But if you haven't played it, you really should play it because it's worth the play. I'm good to play with the books. Like. Uh, call me a kid, but for real. I just love it. And freaking. Freaking fidget spinners. Like. Come on. They use everything in this game. Real world, yes. But in this world, they could come in handy. Let's try. Come on, you get to hover on the fidget spinners. I always like these little bouncy things. Like, it's so weird because I don't know what the heck they're supposed to be. Uh, are they supposed to be those floaty things that hold drinks or? I don't know. A little special.
Yeah, of course the job wasn't finished, but I just, I just had to see if I was gonna live or die. <laughs> Funny. Uh, once that is done, it opens you up to basically the rest of what is like a bouncy castle with holes in it that shoot you up like into the sky when you hover over them. Obviously, I can't manage to do that, but hey, it's really nice. Landing! Doing too much. Well, you know you don't have that much. Yeah. Mm, we're just hovering, so. I was doing things like I could fly. And then the freaking bananas come right. Everything is inflatable. This is such she a kid's game. And I just couldn't get it right. She doesn't make it easy. And I mean that in a good way. I mean like, really good kid at heart type of game. It doesn't matter. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. I just like the whole bouncy castle, bouncy idea of it. I think what makes it fun is playing with somebody who is like interested in playing the game and enjoying themselves and just rocking out with the inner kid inside. Of course it took me forever to get over there because, you know, I'm not going to say that I'm good at games, I just play them because they're fun. And that's all it should be. I always, I always manage to die somehow. But after I do it a couple times, I get it right. <laughs> that's funny. Oh yeah, that thing. That wasn't eventful, but it really, it really needed some teamwork. This was just, All right. I now thought just that the conductor guy was gate. supposed to start up the train thing, but I guess people kissing is enough to power a railroad track. But, dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. I love dinosaurs. I didn't even record the little intro thing on when you got into this little area. I only recorded this part, but this part really uh, pushed the limits of uh, cooperation. Like, you really had to cooperate, otherwise there was no way you were going to do this. Oh, look at him. That Good. thing is spooky and ugly. This part, they could have did without. Even though it wasn't bad, I just don't really like the whole boat thing. And uh, I mean, it's not a bad part. But, and the oh, yeah. boss is kind of easy, <laughs> but I'd rather not do the whole uh, water octopus part Straight again. Hey, little penguins. Hey, happy bee. Should I call you a movie? That was a good movie. Oh, but anyway. Back to this. Weirdo part. Yeah, the tentacles. It's just too much. I feel like it's just too easy to die when you're in the water. Like when you get into the water, it's just like, oh my god, please help me. Kind of like how I felt when I played Sea of Thieves. Yes, it's great when you play with other people, but at the same time, there's no saving you. Jesus. Your boat goes down, you're in the water. Oh, these roller coaster things, like, the roller coaster is not working. Probably. Probably. I don't know. Anyway, it is today. But this thing, the creaking, I just can't. The ducks in this game. Like, I just was cracking up the entire time at that creaking sound. I don't I don't get it. It's a wooden bullet. I mean, a wooden thingy-majig, that's what I'm going to say. 
to the circus. Oh, I actually like, I actually really like this circus part. Not that clown thing because she kind of creepy, but the circus part. Yeah. Rose made the elephant into a queen. Oh my god. Shooting your, uh, I guess I'm gonna call partner across the room to get them to hit the balloon. <laughs> it's crazy. I love that little Ferris wheel that you used to get across there. It's so cute. And then to ride the unicycle, when I was just looking up on Amazon, the fact that they have unicycles that are electric now. I'm just like, could you imagine going to the circus and the guy is on a an electric unicycle that's an experience this part i think this part i really liked about the circus part because well no i think i like the next part better but this part is not bad too like if we could have a game of doing this that would be so cool like a video game of doing that only i would probably find that interesting but i would like that And of course I missed it the first time because it's me, but I got it back. I got it together. I was enjoying swinging way too much, honestly. I wanted to take a moment to not talk because I started feeling like I was talking too much and you probably can't even hear me because I mumble her. So. Wow. You but and Rose yeah. built all of this. I like coming in here. Sure First did. I did not get that that not was bad, a key. Cody. Not bad. I just was like, what is this? Creepy like substance. Uh, it's all right. uh, it's all right. But yeah, at the last minute I saw that it's that birthday. That's what happens when you don't read and you don't pay any attention to what you're doing. Oh, I didn't record the wrecking ball part. That is all right. That's something to look forward to. But this part, like, this game goes from being this game to being an old-timey type game to being one of these weirdo, magical type weird games where you're looking down into the board to play. And then you have a moment where you're doing a Street Fighter thing, fighting a squirrel. It's just like... It's all over the place, but I really like it. This part was just too creepy, and we were just too tired to continue on. So, yeah, that's where we stopped at. So, hopefully next time. Play it.